I'm Dr. Mark Forrest, I'm the Medical Director at Cheshire Fire and Rescue Service and I'm absolutely delighted to be supporting our Burns Awareness Week which is in conjunction with the 16th of October National Burns Awareness Day. Burns are absolutely terrible things to manage. They're excruciatingly painful at the time, they're disfiguring, scarring with both physical and mental effects that can last a whole lifetime. But we can help. We can make a massive difference long before the, the, the ambulance service arrived, the fire and rescue service arrived. Simple first aid measures delivered by anybody can make an enormous difference. But even before that, wouldn't it be even better if we could prevent the burn in the first place? Particularly the vulnerable individuals such as the elderly, young children, especially babies. Burns could be absolutely catastrophic in these individuals. And simple measures that we can take, that split second decision to of where we put our drink or managing a pan or not leaving something hot on a side that could be pulled over or tipped onto somebody. That simple measure could make a lifetime's difference to somebody. Children particularly are vulnerable. Even a hot drink that's been left for 20 minutes to stand that is easily cool enough to be drinking can still cause catastrophic burns and skulls to a young child. Simple first aid is easy to remember. Active cooling of the burn with cold running water the water can be from the tap, from the shower or from a garden hose. Any cool running water as quickly as possible will minimise the damage and minimise the scarring. And that's so important, long before anything in the hospital does. Cool for 20 minutes, and that can be difficult. The casualty won't like you doing it because it is uncomfortable, but that 20 minutes of cold running water is so important. Whilst we're cooling, we need to call the emergency services. Get somebody else to call 999. Don't delay the cooling. But if not, cool them and then, then call for the emergency services to arrive. Once we've cooled for our 20 minutes, we then need to cover the burn to keep it clean and to minimise the pain. We can use cling film for that, or even just kitchen cling film, or we can use some clean cotton, fluff-free cotton. A t-shirt will do, the cleaner the better. But just cover the burn and then we'll wait for help to arrive. 